all eyes were on opposition leader Ahmed Moaz al khatib as he took up Syria's vacant seat at the Arab League for the first time. Bashar al-Assad's government, suspended from the league since 2011 due to their crackdown on the opposition, has called the move theft. Despite submitting his resignation as leader of the opposition, al khatibs presence diverted attention away from divisions in the national coalition. He wasted no time in condemning world powers for their lack of action. Peace be with you from a population that has been slaughtered without any reaction from the world for two years now and has been bombed with all sorts of weapons and yet some governments are still scratching their heads not knowing what to do. He made a passionate plea to U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry to provide Patriot missiles to help secure rebel-held areas in the north from airstrikes. He maintained that Syria's future would be decided by the people and not outside powers. Our correspondent in Doha asks, The Syrian opposition is prominently present and Bashar al-Assad is noticeably absent because of an Arab decision. In this new reality, what are the chances of a political solution to the crisis in Syria? من الدوحة مها برادا يورو نيوز